guys welcome back to my channel for today's video I will be doing a haul so last week I did some shopping and I thought I would show you guys what I purchased so yeah let's get started the first place I what I didn't go to but the first place I bought stuff from was Laura's boutique if you haven't heard from her or about the boutique she has three locations in Los Angeles and an online shop so the first thing I bought was a like romper jumpsuit because it's like long it's like a maxi dress but when I put it on it looks like like just a dress but it's actually like pants so super cool it's all black it's got little straps and it's got the little neck and the only reason I'm not showing it to you like physically it's because when I like pull it up to show you guys in the camera it looks really odd and it just doesn't do it justice so I'm going to insert a picture so that you can see what I'm talking about I promise I bought it I'm not like crazy um, but the second thing I got was this fanny pack so it looks like this it's got like the strap and this is the pouch and it's got like a coppery gold yellow zipper situation so I've been wanting one of these for a while now I've seen them I think it's like Gucci that has them but I was like can't afford that but I also just wanted a fanny pack that was a lot cuter than just like you know like basic cloth ones this one is great it's big if it's everything like phone keys wallet like anything I need it'll fit which is great um also so it comes with these extra straps that you can hang or attach to it and use it like a purse so it is multi-use which is awesome like what better way than or what better thing than to have like something you can use two different ways so that is all i got from laura's boutique I, the next thing, the next place i bought stuff from was ulta and so i got a couple things but first i got the jacqueline hill palette so I know you guys are going to say, like, that's so old, it came out almost a year ago, but I know. Okay, so I've been trying to get a hold of this palette ever since it came out in June of, well, like, last summer, you know? But every time I looked online or I went in stores, they didn't have them. Like, okay, great. So I kind of gave up for some time, but I finally got it, and I'm so excited to, like, have my hands on it took so long just like it took Jackie almost like two years to create it it took me almost a year to get my hands on it so I'm super excited about it it's honestly just as beautiful as everyone says if you don't have it I would definitely recommend it the next thing I got was also a pan was another palette so I got the sleek E10 eyeshadow palette it looks like this and so this one is just like a super inexpensive palette, but I've seen people rave about their highlighting palette, so I wanted to give it a look. So here's what it looks like. I kind of swatched it earlier to check it out, so there's like some spots, but it comes with this like janky brush, like not to be petty or like rude or whatever but it's just like you know something I used when I was like five <laughs> or like a kid to like do my makeup um so it's kind of cute but I'm gonna swatch a few of these to give you guys a look or so you can so you guys can see what they look like let's pick this blue this green and this one okay so here are some of the these on my fingers like the blue green and it's like a coppery yellowy I don't even know what color this is to be honest but I'm gonna put them on my arm so that you can see okay so they do feel like really buttery and they're all most of them are metallic I don't know if you can see my arms I'm super like pale but that's what they look like I really like these colors they look a lot different on the skin I feel like than they do on like in the palette but they're they look like they're gonna create some good looks so we'll see I'm just gonna wipe this off because I do not want to get eyeshadow 
on my bed because I am filming in my room. Got it on. Alright. But yeah, like I said, that palette is super inexpensive. It was like $10, $15. I think there was like a sale on it. So I'm really excited to see what it can do. Alright, moving on. Oh, okay. So last month, or February, which was a short month, was Ulta Skin Care Month. So they sent me a like skincare bundle which I'm super excited about it was like it's like a $50 value and it was free after a certain amount of purchase or a certain like price purchase but yeah so I'm gonna show you what I got there all right this is okay so actually I did it they didn't give me this but I got it but it is the I do care black cat headband and it looks like this See, so it's just like so when I wash my hair or put on my makeup, I can just like pull all my hair back. As you can see, I have a million baby hairs and they do not stay at all. Um, the next thing they gave me was the Purity Made Simple Pore Extractor, which is an exfoliating clay mask. And I'll just show you guys what it looks like. Looks like this little guy it's just like a little baby sample size um i like clay masks i'm excited about that and then they gave me a couple other face masks or basically everything i got from them was face masks but different sorts of them so this is the origins clear improvement active charcoal mask to clear pores as well so you know i think they think i have some nasty pores <laughs> just kidding <laughs> um but those are always nifty Another face mask they got me, or they gave me, was the Bee Berry Clear Illuminating Peel Mask. So it looks like this, and I think this is like one of, I don't know if it's like Ulta brand, but I know they have like a couple of these at, in their store, and it is, sorry guys, my camera cut off, like I was saying, I was talking about their face mask, I know they have a couple different other ones, but yeah, I got the berry one, and then... The next thing I got were a couple of sheet masks. So one of them is the revitalizing oxygen mask. So it's like the bubbling one. <gasps> oh, I've actually been really wanting to try this, but I haven't had the chance because I have so many face masks. I subscribe to Face Tori, I think that's what it's called. And every month they send like four face mask I think that's yeah you can choose like between four or seven or buy them individually and I have the four a month subscription and I have been piling them up but I will link you below to face story because I know if you use like the a certain link then they'll give you like two face masks for free on your first purchase so who doesn't love free face masks and then the next one's just like one of the Tony Moly's Tony Mo yeah Tony Moly Tony Moly I don't know exactly how it's, it's supposed to be said, but yeah, one of these. And then I also got... Oh, okay. So I got the I Do Care Disco Kitten face mask, and it is the Illuminating Diamond Peel Off Mask. It doesn't say what it's like supposed to do. So it looks like this. It's just white. The packaging is like really pretty just because it's like plain and like simple. Like I don't know. It looks just looks clean. Oh, okay. It smells really good. Okay, so it looks really weird. Ooh, I don't want to spill it, but it it looks kind of like not slime. Like a little bit thinner than slime. Like if you make slime at home. But, and it has, I can see like the glitter in it, um, but it's supposed to go on your face wet, obviously, because it's like a liquid, and then it dries off, and then it's all shimmery, and then you can just completely peel it off your face. So I'm excited to see what this does. I've seen it all over like social media, and, like Instagram videos, so we'll see. Um, the last thing I got in that skincare set was the Peter Thomas Roth Irish More Mud purifying black mask and it's just like a little baby like this 
which is black. Um, it smells like, I don't know, something familiar. I can't, like, put a name to it. It sounds like, not Play-Doh. I don't know, something from my childhood for sure, though. And this face mask is a purifying black ma mask. Sorry. Bleh. It has the hijaki seaweed hydrates volcanic ad volcanic ash revitalizes activated charcoal draws out toxins and impurities it's purifying purifying refining and decongestioning hydrating max mask sorry i cannot talk today but yeah i'm really excited to try this out i've heard good things about peter thomas roth i'm pretty sure they have like another peel off mask too that or like that it basically just exfoliates your whole skin but i could be wrong but i'm not sure i think it is the next place i got things from was tarte and tarte's like one of my favorites like i know that all of their stuff is like cruelty free so i love that or i'm pretty sure all of it if not most and vegan also so the first thing i got was this eye set so it comes with lashes, mascara, eyeliner, and then like glitter liners. And I'm honestly really excited to try it out because I have their mascaras and I really like it. I haven't tried their eyeliner. Actually, just kidding. I think I've tried their Man Eater eyeliner because my little sister has that. And she really likes it and I borrowed it and it worked really well. But I don't think that's... This is like the Tardiest Pro. And then their lashes. These lashes look i don't know i like simple not simple lashes but like more natural i guess as natural as you can get so these look awesome i can wear these like on a daily basis so i'm excited about that and then oh okay so i actually got the rainforest of the sea tart high performance naturals lip saver treatment primer so I think when I read it on the website, it said that it's supposed to be like a lip treatment for like dry lip. Oh, it smells like sweet tarts. Mm, or, or Smarties. I think it's Smarties that it smells like. Oh my god. Okay. Mmm. Yeah. Sorry. It just smells really good. But I'm pretty sure it's a, like supposed to be... A lip treatment, like tub revitalizer, lips, but oh, okay, actually it says apply to lips as a treatment or before lipstick to prep and prime, allow to dry before applying lip color. Okay, so yeah, I was right. It is a lip treatment, which I honestly need this winter. I guess it's like almost spring, but I live in Humboldt County currently, and let me tell you, it's cold all the time. So my skin is like dry and dull, my lips are like dry and chapped, like constantly, no matter how much chapstick I put on. So, I needed that. Um, last but not least, I know Tarte um, gets like, you get a free sample with all of your orders and I got the Ready Set Radiance Skin Mist. It just looks like that and I'm supposed to shake it. Mm, that smells good too. So I'm not going to spray it on my face because I'm not priming or setting my face at all. Like I have bare face, just literally did wash my face and did all my skincare this morning. So zero makeup, just don't need it. But I'm excited to try that out because I've heard really good things about it. So I'm hoping it's as good as they say it is. And if so, I will definitely be buying the full size because I'm running out of my primer. Or not primer sorry my setting spray i mean i guess you could use it to prime your face but not really i mean some you can oh yeah but and then lastly but definitely not least i got this All right so this looks really weird but so i'm like a tart let i said i don't know i have their rewards program and i'm like the second tier or something so i get tons of like cool rewards extra rewards for my points or i don't know but i get cool things for my rewards and i think this one was just available i don't know if it's just for me for everybody but it's supposed to be where 
you put your makeup in it and then you just kind of like bundle it up so it's supposed to be like a purse and then like inside this is my makeup I just don't want to drop it and then you can extend it flat so that you can see everything when it's flat but everything but that flew out but yeah anyways I'm really excited about that because I never go over to my friends or even when I do my makeup here if I want to do it somewhere else I can just put them there and see everything I have and then just bundle it up and get ready to go Alright guys, that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't already, please subscribe and like. See you guys next time.